So let's quickly talk about eczema. Um, I've got eczema. I've also got asthma. Apparently, there's a link between the two. I have no idea. Um, but you can see I've got some rashes down there. Look, I've been breaking out lately. Let's be real. Usually, my eczema is not too bad, and it's usually confined to my inner elbow down here. Um, it's usually just confined to that one area. Um, sometimes, maybe a few times a year, I'll get flare-ups around my eyes, particularly my right eye. Flare-up has happened again, so I've got another flare-up, but this time it's pretty intense. So I'm currently trialing something at the moment to see if this combination of things works or helps with eczema. If that is the case and it works and it clears up, I'm going to share my tips with you. I mean, it sucks. It sucks to have. It's annoying. It's on your face. I mean, you can't really avoid it. Oh, I'm so over this. It's flared up a lot lately. Um, so it's a lot of redness, a lot of itching, discomfort, cracking, stinging. It's not pleasant. This morning it wasn't too bad either, but now it's really flared up. You could see the eczema is just um, very dominating on my face, on my eyes, especially on that side. Um, yeah, everyone at work is just saying, mentioning it, how bad it is, and it's really irritating. Um, I don't know, I'm just going to keep trying to get rid of it, guys, but uh, it's pretty frustrating. Um, yeah. So my eczema flare-up is spreading now to my chest, can you see that color difference? <laughs> Look at that. That's how itchy that whole area has been. And it spreads across to the other side. See all that redness? So, um, yeah, this has been super itchy as well. So this is without doubt my worst flare up that I've had. Um, so, but uh, currently at the moment it's flaring like a mofo, as you can see. It looks like I've been punched in the eye. It's extremely red, very sensitive, very raw, very painful. Um, I would say not really painful. I would say it just stings a lot. Uh, but as you can see, that is um, that is what eczema of the eyelid looks like. So, look, it sucks because A, it's on your face. So, it's right there for everybody to see. Um... I know very little about eczema um, and I don't know what's triggering it because, um, you know, even I'm getting um, eczema like here on my chest. See how it's red and rashy? I've never had that before. So I feel like something is happening. Like I'm reacting terribly to something and I'm trying to think about what it is that I'm having. Like, is it my food? Is it my environment? Like, it could literally be a hundred things. So I'm going to go to the doctors. I'm just going to get an allergy test. I haven't had one in a while. As you guys know, you could develop an allergy to something any point in your life. So you don't have to be born with an allergy. You could pick up and drop off allergies throughout your lifetime. I'm, I'm, I'm trying everything. And at the moment, nothing has been proving to be that effective. At least not in the long run. Maybe I'll get a little temporary relief. So I'm just going to see what I, I'm going to try a few different things to get rid of this eczema, especially around the eyelid. That's my focus area at the moment. I'm going to try a few different techniques, a few different angles, and I will see what works best with my body and I'll share with you the results. Uh, and I'll tell you how long it took and all of that stuff. But in the meanwhile, this sucks. You know, it, it, it's, um, you know, the skin is cracked around the eyelid, very sensitive area. It stings a lot, lots of stinging. It's very sensitive around the area there. It, it feels burning. It's very distracting throughout your day. Your eyes always kind of leaking and it's a terrible thing. It's really annoying, but, um, you know, I, I can't really complain too much. I've got all my limbs. I've got my sight. I've got my hearing. Hey, you know, it's just not the prettiest thing on the planet. But I'm surprised with how many people have eczema um, around the world. Um, and, you know, poor people, I've seen some people that have almost the whole face affected by it. So for me to have one eye, I mean, look, it looks like I've been punched in the face, particularly in the eye. I'll take that and run. 
all right? Hopefully it doesn't get any worse, but I'll keep that progress with you. Um, let me let, let me know about your eczema experience, guys. Um, do you have eczema? How long have you had it for? Do you have any tips or trip? You know, do you have any tips or tricks up your sleeve to help me to recover? Because I really don't want to go to work like this, and I want it to recover as quickly as possible. So, if you have any tips that worked for you, please let me know in the comment section. Uh, hopefully, I'll get better soon. If you're an eczema sufferer, I hope you you, you recover asap. And um, peace and love to you all, guys. I hope you have an amazing night. See ya.